hey guys welcome back to the channel today's recipe is something i make quite a lot myself and i thought obviously why didn't i just share the recipe it's something that's quite familiar to people but in a different way so this is called mamba it's haitian peanut butter but it has scotch bonnet pepper in it that may be something many of us aren't familiar with but i promise you it works really really well so our ingredients really simple we have some monkey nuts in the shell which will be red skin nuts once they're peeled we have some sea salt, we have some soft brown sugar, a little bit of rapeseed oil and the star ingredient, our scotch bonnet pepper. So to start with, we need to just peel these nuts. Obviously, I am not going to make you watch me do all of them. It took me a little while, but we just want to remove the outside shell and remove the skin so you're left with that pale nut just like this. We need to roast these now. You can either do it in the oven or I've got a preheated pan here. We're just going to add the nuts to the pan and toast them. This took not even five minutes. You know when they're ready because you can start to smell them and the colour will start to change a little bit. Whilst they start to toast, I'm just going to get our pepper here and cut it in half and drop it into the pan to toast that off a little as well. I'm cutting this in half because this pepper is a little big, um, but you just want one small pepper. If you don't want it too hot, then I would de-seed it. As you can see, the nuts are starting to blister a bit and I can smell them now. So I'm just going to pour them in the bowl here. We want to add to this our brown sugar, the salt, and then give it a quick mix. Now this is basically ready to be lit. So we're gonna add this to our blender and we're gonna put this on high and start pulsing it until it's really starting to break down. Just before we put this back on now, we're gonna add in the oil. I'm using rapeseed oil because that's what I had, but you could use coconut oil, whichever you have. It's better to use something with less of a flavor because that will affect the final taste of the peanut butter. All we have to do is blitz it until it's really smooth and silky and runny. This took all in all about five minutes, not even. And here we have. Can you see how smooth it is? Really silky, really runny. So to store this, we're just going to add it into a jar. And because it has the pepper in, I will keep this in the fridge. It will change the texture a little bit, but if you bring it to room temperature, it's fine. If you want this thicker, then I would use more nuts, less oil. And that is basically it. That is my recipe for mamba. I hope you tried this one as well and if you do please tag and share your pictures so my favorite way to eat this is just on some toast sourdough preferably i hope you like this one guys comment below for anything else you would like to see me do until the next time peace and love